Hey YouTube, what's up? Uh, we're gonna do something crazy today. The Pocky One Chip Challenge, the new one. I did it last year. Man, where am I supposed to look? Over here? Oh, hi. This is blue. I don't know why. It's supposed to be hotter. People are getting all kinds of sick over this thing. Wah, can't handle it. Blech. Let's see what we can do. Let's open this up. I'm going to do it in front of uh, Lance the Magic Dragon today. Instead of Post Malone, we got my dragon. Say hi, Lance. He's going to watch. And you can eat that lettuce while you watch. How's that? All right. Let's open this up. Down and eat. Forget the rules. I believe all you do is you eat the chip, the whole chip, nothing but the chip, and you are not allowed to have any water or milk or any relief. Think for five minutes, but let's check this out. Okay. Johnny, what to expect? Ooh, that was horrible. What to expect? Number one is the tongue takeover. Number two is shock the senses. Surge of tears, then jolt to the gut, and then a voltage overload. All right. This one's got scorpion peppers and reaper. All right, eat the entire chip. Prove it. Show us your tongue. Blah. Wait as long as possible before drinking or eating anything. Post your reaction on social media. Now that's tricky, because last year it wasn't that bad. I probably could have waited countless hours without drinking. Uh, so I don't know. Maybe we'll do a little timer, maybe not. Maybe we'll just chill out for a while. And uh, if I'm not suffering, then I'll, I'll consider it successful. What do you think about that? Let's do it. All right, here it is. Completely sealed. Tamper-proof. No cheating. Let's take a little whiff of this thing. Cool. Oh, yeah. Nope. That is no joke. Yeah. Oh, look at that friggin' color of this thing. That looks like death. Oh, man. There's like tear gas in the air from opening that. Whew. Here we go, y'all. Oh, my God. I'm not going to be terrifying. I have a lot more powder on it this year. Very dry. So far, it just tastes like a pile of sand. So that's not good. No oh, dog, you do not want to lick my fingers. Mm -mm. Hmm. I know it's going to be hot. It's not doing too much yet, but this one's definitely grosser than the last year. That does not taste good. It tastes like sandy mud mixed with a little heat. <coughs> All right. It's definitely kicking in. My mouth is on fire for sure. Blue tongue chip is gone. Blah. Oh, that's my shirt. Ah. Blah. That's kind of fun. Blah. I know, dog. What do you think? Am I crazy? What do you think, Lance? Oh, Lance is going to town on the lettuce. All right, let's see what we got, because I feel a few things going on down here. It definitely took over the tongue. No tears yet. We're on step four already. The jolt to the gut. It doesn't feel good down there. I'll tell you that. Voltage overload. It's building for sure. It is hot. I don't know if it's hotter than last year. Maybe. Let's see what time it is. 
1120. Let's see if it all goes away in five minutes or so. We'll just chill out. What do you want to do? Want to get funky? Oh, hey, buddy. Dog's got himself a cow ear today. Look at the size of this thing. Here you go. Want to say hi? Yeah. Ooh, she was warm. Yeah. It feels even hotter when you take a breath. Now, these challenges are hot. They're nothing compared to, like, the Johnny Scoville Death Nut Challenge or those friggin' cheese balls I had. Oh my God. Those gave me a little bit of panic. Like, literally was wondering if I was just going to die. <laughs> and after the cheese ball challenge, I woke up at, like, 2 in the morning. You guys don't know this because I never really did an update on it. But, man, that was rough. It was very rough. It came out of all ends. I don't recommend doing that unless you uh, are prepared to lose in 24 hours. The Pocky One Chip Challenge I did last year was hot as hell, but like 10 minutes later, you're pretty much back to normal. This one's supposed to be hotter, so maybe 15 minutes. We'll see, but it's already starting to calm down inside. My lips are very hot. My tongue is very hot. Definitely building up some of that strange saliva that hot peppers make you make. Tongue still blue. Bye. Ah, it's going away. Maybe that's the key. If I can get that blue off my tongue, maybe it'll go away. Yeah. Hot chips. Who'd have thunk? Whew. Still there. Not quite as intense. My eyes are coming down. It's hot. I see a lot of people freaking out on the internet, but maybe those people aren't used to hot peppers and stuff. I do eat a lot of this kind of stuff. That gives me a little bit more of an edge. But I haven't done a challenge in a while, so... Uh, if I was doing them regularly, like someone like Johnny Scoville eats like Reaper peppers for midnight snack, you know, he wouldn't even feel this chip. For your average person that doesn't do hot stuff, it would ruin your day for sure. I'm right in the middle where it probably ruined five minutes for me. And then uh, it's already subsiding. It's pretty much just a, a lip sting now. Two minutes. So three more minutes will be like the five minute mark where I think it's probably going to finish out around five minutes for me, actually. It's already starting to clear. Yeah, last week I did uh, a two-pound gigante taco grande, taco gigante challenge at Margarita's. It used to be an hour. Now it's like you just finish it. But if you, it used to be you finish it in an hour and you get free tacos for a year. So it's like one taco a week for a year. 52 tacos is pretty sweet. I finished it in nine minutes and 24 seconds. Uh, it wasn't pretty. I was wearing it. My beard had taco, but... For a two-pound taco, it was well-built. It was delicious. It, you know, it's got the chip is just by itself. The tortilla shell itself is this big custom, really flavorful tortilla shell. And then it had all the meat. So it had like pulled pork, it had shredded chicken, ground beef. It had bacon. It had smothered in cheese and sour cream, guac, and uh, tons of pickled jalapenos. I think if the jalapenos were like fresh, bright green jalapenos and there were that many it was like a jar of them that would have slowed me down a little bit just because it's just so much of it but uh because they were pickled jalapenos it just went right down uh it was good but i didn't film it that's too bad next challenge i i teased this a while back i just haven't found the time to do it i think this chip they said this chip might be something like two million scoville and I think the next challenge is like 9 million or something ridiculous. I'll grab it real quick. It's, uh, let's see. It is the Toe of Satan. This will be the next one. 
The toe of Satan is a gummy, like a gummy toe on a stick. This thing's terrifying. Nine million Scoville. It's made of pure, like, extract, like Reaper extract. Uh, this thing says it's a five-minute challenge. You eat the thing, you wait five minutes. It goes from coward to wimp to show off to loss of feeling to really. And then at five minutes, this is 911. What is your emergency? So we're going to do this. Uh, i got to pick a good time, a good day where I'm not doing anything just in case. It does completely ruin my body, but I love gummies, so we'll see what happens. Yeah, where are we at now? All right, so it's been five minutes since the chip has been completely gone. I'm good, stomach's good, mouth's good, everything's good. A little bit of sting like here and here and on the very tip of my tongue. It's not making me want to rush and go get something to drink. Um, I'd consider that challenge one. Uh, cool. I like these. I mean, I don't, I'd have to practice a lot, but I wonder if like you could handle making a small plate of nachos with these things. I mean, that would, that would suck, but it would be a good challenge. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe next year when they release it, I'll put like 10 of them on a plate with cheese and sour cream and guac and try to chop them down. That's probably asking for trouble. That's definitely asking for trouble. But hey, man, that's what we do. So look out for this one. I don't know. Maybe next week we'll tackle this. Let me know what you think about that. Let me know if you like these challenges or if you want me to just stick to reptile stuff. Either way, I had fun doing it. Until next time, people, have fun.